Hello friend, welcome to plastic product design series. In this video, we will discuss the thermoplastic and thermosetting plastic. So if you are new here, please subscribe the channel and hit the bell icon so that you will get the updated videos from mechanical design Atta. Plastic material actually categorized into two different parts like uh, thermoplastics and the thermosetting plastics. So this category is based on the recyclability of the material whether it is recyclable or whether it is not recyclable. So thermoplastic materials are uh, uh, recyclable so uh, after the use or the use products we can melt and shape again and we can create the new product in the uh, thermoplastics but in thermocytic plastics actually once the this uh, past plastic get the shape so after the uh, means uses we can't use the this type of plastics again Pla thermocytic plastics actually it is irreversible process and uh, in the chemical reaction actually it forms the rigid and three dimensional network so because of that we can't use the material of the thermosetting plastic so it is irreversible process and it is not uh, recyclable thermoplastics generally it is a less strong a more durable and the thermosetting plastics are the brittle and the strong and more durable and rigid and it is also high resistance to the heat so here you can see the different material of the thermoplastic so here you can see the applications also so under the thermoplastics the poly, uh, the material is come uh, will come like a polyethylene polypropylene pvc ps pmma nylon pet abs and pc so these are the materials actually comes under the uh, thermoplastics and we can use this material and after the use we can uh, uh, reshape again by melting and uh, using the same process and we can get the new product so like a polypropylene you can e, uh, the application you can see in the plastic bags bottle and the container and pp generally used in the automotive parts textile and the packaging so in the upcoming videos where we are discussing the different uh, uh, plastic material so in that we will see the in detail about the applications where it is using and we will discuss the property of the material as well so here you can see the pvc it is used in the pipes and you can see the thermoplastics polymer applications uh, images here and the thermosetting plastics uh, the material uh, like uh, epoxy resin phenol formaldehyde uh, Melal mine uh, formaldehyde. So these are the some materials will comes under the thermosetting plastics or the polymer. You can see. So uh, the epoxy resin generally used in the adhesive coatings, uh, composite materials. Phenol formaldehyde or generally we call it as a backlight. It is used in as a insulator and polyurethane. It is generally used as a uh, foam coating and the elastomer and uh, unsaturated polyester resin it is generally used in the fiberglass reinforced plastics and the automotive components and here you can see the thermosetting plastics image uh, material uh, applications like in the glue painting uh, foam rubbers uh, okay in medical instruments so likewise these are the uh, examples of the thermosetting plastics or the polymer so if i summarize the what is meant by thermoplastics and the thermosetting so considering the recyclability so the thermoplastics actually it is a recyclable and multiple times we can recycle the material uh, and the thermosetic plastics it is irreversible and uh, we can't uh, remelt after the uh, using or the once it is set uh, so regarding the heat resistance so the thermoset plastics offer the higher heat resistance and maintain the structure integrity uh, better than the thermoplastics and the mechanical strength so the thermoset plastics uh, having the stronger and more rigid and the 
thermoplastics are more flexible and the less brittle so regarding the processing so the thermoplastics we can reshape and we can uh, by melting and uh, we can use the use that material for the new product and the thermoset uh, plastics are the irreversible we can we can't uh, remelt and uh, create the new product again so in the next video we will discuss the different type of plastic material and their property so if you like this video please like share and subscribe the channel and hit the bell icon and you can share with your friend and watch the complete plastic uh, design series uh, so thank you for watching see you in the next video